Dad, could you please come in the balcony? See, a pigeon has built a nest here. Is that so? Yes, Dad. There are some eggs too in the nest. I'm wondering, where have these eggs come from? Mohan, these eggs are of this pigeon. All birds lay eggs to produce their babies. Dad, does it mean that the baby birds are already there in these eggs? Mohan, at this time, baby birds are still developing inside the eggs. Oh, is that so? But why is the pigeon sitting on one of her eggs? Will the egg not break? Ha ha ha! No, Mohan. The parent bird sits on its eggs to keep them warm. This process is known as incubation. But why do they need to do so? Mohan, if birds do not incubate their eggs, then those eggs will not develop into baby birds. Dad. How do the baby birds come out from their eggs? Mohan, because of incubation, young one grows fully inside the egg. After it has grown fully, the eggshell breaks and baby bird comes out of it. This is known as hatching. Do all animals produce their young ones this way? No, Mohan, not all of them. Only some, like birds, reptiles. And insects lay eggs, from which their young ones hatch out. Whereas mammals such as monkeys, mice, cats, dogs, dolphins, bats, whales, and human beings directly give birth to their young ones, which develop inside the mother's body. This process is called reproduction. But after birth for some time, the baby feeds on mother's milk. Dad. What are mammals? Mohan, the animals that have hair on their body are called mammals. Friends, you have seen how different animals produce their young ones. The young ones of these animals resemble their parents. But do you know that in case of insects and frogs, the young ones that are hatched from their eggs do not exactly look like their parents. Now. Let us learn about the reproduction in frog. The life cycle of frog consists of different stages. First, a female frog lays eggs in water. These eggs hatch into tadpoles. A tadpole has a tail and fins, but no legs, which make it look like a tiny fish. It swims and breathes through the gills in the water. After a few days. The legs and lungs begin to grow, while its tail shrinks. Lungs help the mature tadpole to breathe on land. After some time, the tadpole grows into a complete frog.